Petro's restaurant. Hello everybody, my name's Eddie and today I'm gonna go see some McLaren's. Yay! But, so... What are you going to? There's alcohol. Oh shit. So, they opened up a new McLaren in Chicago, in downtown Chicago. Before you had to go up north and, you know. And I almost died. I mean, I'm still dying. Uh, so yeah, we're gonna go and we're gonna go cry. They have an MSOHS, which is amazing. Oh. Amazing. We can see Aladdin here. Yeah. yeah. What? Whoa. Diversity. And, you know, since every single car YouTuber is turning into a food YouTuber, I guess I'll hop on the bandwagon and then when we go somewhere to eat, I'll do a little food vlog. Oh, yeah. <laughs> All right, so. I'll oh, well, because she's got an internal transition. P100 D with ludicrous mode. Ah, well. Almost missed it. Yeah, whatever. All right, everybody. The food vlog is underway. I went to the uh, corner bait <laughs> on Randolph and whatever it is, and uh, I got my sale for uh, some chicken carbonara. It has little pieces of chicken and a giant piece of garlic bread, and I got some honey. So yeah. You got put honey on your shit? Oh fuck okay. yeah. No. Um I got I got lemonade. She got raspberry lemonade. Raspberry lemonade. Salt pepper. Taste test. We're gonna we're gonna try this and I'm gonna let you all know if this place is fuckable or not. Gonna gonna Sorry. That was gross. It's okay. All right. <laughs> Couldn't really taste much, honestly. Let's try a piece of chicken. And oh. bacon. Gotta huh? get bacon. Where's the bacon? Oh shit. These are some big ass pieces of bacon. Look at that. Look at that. There's a pea on it too. Ah! <laughs> Damn it, why am I like this? Mm. That's some good ass bacon. Nice. We're gonna try some of this garlic bread. Good. Yeah. Uh, that's some pretty good garlic bread. You're welcome. <laughs> I brought you to this place. If it weren't for me, you wouldn't be here right now. I was gonna come regardless to require. Okay. Anyway, thank you. So this is um, this is some good stuff, you know. What? Nothing. You got you got that look that's like oh god. Oh god, help me. <laughs> Oh. No, I won't. Okay. That's fine. Um, you don't need my help. No, I don't need saving. You know why? Why? Because I'm gonna die anyways. Alright. Corner Bakery gets a 4 out of 5 for me. It's pretty good. It's not perfect, but it's pretty good. It's perfect? Uh uh. How is it not perfect? I wish this was a little bit thicker, this bread. And Portillo's are way thicker. But then again, the cost difference is pretty big because this was ten seventy, and Portillo's like, just like, one of these is like 12 bucks without the drink and without like anything else. So it's like, yeah. it evens out. But if you're in a rush and you need to eat some kind of pasta, I recommend the Cafe Bakery. The next part will be a McLaren. Be sure of it. Alright everybody, what? Uh, <laughs> Alright, we are here at the McLaren in Chicago. There's a beautiful 675 LT and a fucking 570S, right? No, that's a 570 GT in Volcano Orange. I'm kind of freaking out. Oh my god. Ooh. Look, look at it. Where are you going? The door's over here. 
We can go inside. Oh man. Alright, I'll bring you some footage from inside. I'm getting a little emotional, but <laughs> look at this. This is the exact one I would get. This this is uh it's so perfect. It's perfect. I'm excited. Wow. <laughs> wow. Oh that man. Ass. It's so that pretty. There's... I can't. I literally can't. I, there's so they're everywhere. Carbon fiber. There's there's carbon fiber there, there's some there, there's right in there, there's there, there. It, it's everywhere. <laughs> I can't. This is the this is the spider version. You can tell by the little thing, so it goes down. That's this is the exact one that Quavo has. No. Way. Yeah, this is the exact spec, a white 650s. Beautiful. It's a little bit dirty, actually. Who did, who did that? <laughs> Clean it. No, what? Don't touch it! Don't touch it! Don't touch it! Another 650s. Beautiful. Beautiful. We got over here 570 s finished in white let's see the price of this bad boy 203 203,000 great with that you don't get the carbon fiber side cells you do not get the carbon fiber mirrors you don't get the carbon fiber splitter there's really no carbon fiber actually huh. so for 203 you can get one of these with nothing, pretty much. Nothing is carbon fiber. Oh, this is perfect for Edgar. Yeah, so no carbon fiber on a base McLaren. That's $203,000 for a 570S. Unfortunately, not that bad. It still looks pretty good, but I mean, come yeah. on, you need the Do curve. you just press the button and you go reverse? Yeah, that's how it is. You just go ping, ping, ping. That's like so dumb. Why? Because you could die so easy that you just press a button and you go backwards. If you can afford this, you're not an idiot. <laughs> and there's the engine, the beautiful 3.8 liter V8 twin turbo. Look at that heat shield wrap right there. Amazing, amazing. Leading to the exhausts on the bottom. It doesn't have the stealth exhaust, which... It's dirty. Where? Hmm. Nice, nice and white. All right, so we have the 570 GT here. This one is retailing for two hundred and eighteen thousand dollars. So, with that, you don't, you do not get the carbon fiber. This is the 570 GT. That's what makes your car stop. Those are called calipers. Mm. So when you press on the brakes, the caliper has two little. Well, in this case, I'm pretty sure there are four pistons, and they push two little pads, and that pushes against this right here, the the rotor, it and that like causes that, friction. Right? Yeah. I've seen that. So yeah, so for a base 570 GT, it doesn't look like it doesn't look like it has the carbon ceramics, no carbon fiber on the side. I like that it has the orange, and then it has the red. Well, for real, who did this? I don't like that. Who did? Who spec this car out? Terrible job. The good thing about the 570S wall, or, or bad thing, is that you get an extra trunk, so you can actually sort things if you actually want to. But then you can't see the engine because it's covered up by that. So take it as you will. That's the trunk. That's the trunk. You get an extra trunk. I mean, like yeah, because the frunk. You open the. There's no engine up there, so you open it on. These cars are beautiful. Either way, even if they are a bit mismade well at least this one is but next we're gonna go to the mso hs which is the rarest car i'll ever see probably there's only 25 in the world and it's a uh, radical huh so this is the mso hs it has bruce mclaren's kiwi because the guy who made it his his logo was a kiwi like way back when kiwi yeah, like the bird like his formula one thing there's only 25 of these in the world. Um, huh? 
whatever. Uh, so, differences than the 675 LT, you get these MSO uh, vents. You get the canards right here, finished in green carbon fiber. Amazing. The roof scoop. And then you get, of course, the giant fixed wing. Actually, no, it's not fixed. It's It can pivot provide more downforce and you get the green carbon fiber everywhere actually even inside the engine bay so I'm pretty sure yeah it's still a 3.8 liter space. none <laughs> it's still a 3.8 liter and has 688 horsepower and it has center mounted exhaust with gold foil so baller beautiful car Expensive, rare, nice, and I'm glad I can see it. Going back to more rare, I mean more common McLaren. This is a 650S. Whoa. I love that. What? The red stitching? Yeah. This is the 650S Spider. You can tell by the little part and the thing. Finished in metallic gray. It does have a lot of carbon fiber options, so good stuff. You have the little wing compared to the 675 LT. Even the rear bumper is finished in carbon fiber too, which is pretty nice. See that nice weave. Just like my phone case, it's not fucking fake. Anyway, uh, here's your gas can. Your gas can. When you're filling up, it's on the left side, driver's side. Carbon, just like mine. carbon fibers, just like mine. No way. Yeah. Holy that's shit. That's crazy. So. Yep. Inside is black leather with red contrast stitching and the carbon fiber center console, which I love so much. Yes. Another 650S over here, Spider, of course. Black. Black with the carbon fiber front splitter. Carbon fiber mirrors. Carbon fiber side skirts. Alcantara interior with white contrast stitching and really carbon fiber. I like white. What color are the calipers? All black. Wait, so I'm black on black on white. What is that? What? Alcantara. It's like the highest grade suede you can buy. Okay. Uh, yeah. Here's the carbon fiber uh, bumper. So yeah. Good, nice. So this is the 675 LT Spider. Um, as you know, it's the upgraded 650S. It has a long tail version. Carbon fibers, front splitter, of course. Orange calipers. It's a chicane gray with orange contrast stitching, orange seat belts, and the carbon fiber interior center console. It does have the carbon fiber uh, side skirts intakes side intakes and the uh bumper has of course a center mounted exhaust and it looks amazing this is part of my favorite mclaren the 688 hs is amazing because it's rare but i would take the 675 look at that look at that piece like this is a you can't really tell on camera but this is a giant fucking intake look at my hand compared to that like it's fucking huge you can put a baby in there and it'll get sucked into your engine. Anyway, here's a 570 GT finished in Volcano Orange. I don't really like this spec, mostly because it's orange on orange. And I think that's a little bit too much, in my opinion. Plus, it's not doesn't match up because you have the McLaren Orange with the Volcano Orange. And it doesn't really make sense. But you don't even have the carbon fiber intake, so it's like whatever. But I do like that little soup, you know? Soup. And how much does this one cost? It's a cool 219. How much is this one? They're actually selling this one, not the 688 HS. This one is $423,410. Nice. What do you think? I love it. Um, I need a sugar daddy like now. Any sugar mamas or daddies that matter are watching, hit Please. me up. Hit me up. Please. 
I can take you here and we can have a good time. Uh, so yeah, that's the McLaren store in Chicago. Still want to cry, but you know, can't cry for the fans yet. It's kind of hot in here too. <laughs> you're sweating. It's really warm. It's actually nice in here. I don't like it. I oh, think you're just really high. I think so. Anyway, another difference that I just noticed that I never noticed, the 675 LT only has one wiper and the 570 series has two wipers. That's interesting. Very interesting. See? Except the I don't understand the discrepancy of why these two are Thanks for the invite. Tell Eddie he's a bitch. Oh, nice. Anyway, I also really like those wheels over there. And these wheels, they're okay. They're the Stealth Series, but fuck you. Um, <gasps> no! <laughs> I'm sorry, Andrea. Oh, yeah. Sh shout out to Joe. Joe from uh, from Motorola. You're the best. If you are actually watching this video, <gasps> they have the covered ceramic brace on this one. Oh, man. What? These, these, the rotors, they're made of carbon fiber, too, and ceramic. Like, it's like a composite mixture, see? It's like the specs, carbon fiber, you see that? And then what it's like the ceramic. Fuck? That makes it stop even more better. It's huh? Crazy. It's crazy. Who came up with this? People who have nothing better to do and have too much money. Why? Has the Pirelli Trofeo R's. And they are amazing. You get the McLaren emblem right here, center. Little cap with... <laughs> and it's great. It's... They're amazing cars. I... <sighs> Follow me on Instagram, Pablito Monarres. That's M O N A R Z, and then you'll see a bunch of these pictures. But oh, God. this is all I'm going to be posting for the next couple of days. So I'm probably going to lose a lot of followers. This is actually really nice. I know. Thank you for bringing me here. I love it. Thank you for coming. It would, it would have been a lot weirder if I was just here by myself with a phone talking to myself. All right, everybody. Hit a comment, drop a like, subscribe or whatever. Cry a little. Cry a little, because I might never be here again. Also, this 570 GT has the Bang & Olufsen upgraded. You can see the little tweeter right there. So this has a 17 speaker surround sound system. It's pretty cool. Anyway, that's it for today. And have a good day. You're playing a lot of